Hey guys, I'm LB, and we're gonna check out a map from a person who keeps changing their name constantly. If you look, uh, they used to be Amber Orange or whatever, and, uh, like, just about every time they request a map, they have a different name, and also, like, not only is their Steam name different every time, the name of the account that requests the map is also different every time, and is not the same as the Steam account name. I think they're intentionally trying to confuse you, but anyway, this is Frozen Latte by a person who keeps changing their name. The difficulty is easy medium, nothing tastes better than a coffee on a rainy morning day. P.S. I finally begun to make custom thumbnails. Hashtag BMod 2.4. Right, let's check it out. Just so you know, I have to go give a deposition for an upcoming trial. In case that interests you. Interesting. This cube has a very... coffee-colored... color to it, doesn't it? I'm gonna call that the coffee cube. Right. This almost seems coffee-colored as well, but I think it's just a side effect of the lighting. Well, anyway, we have a light bridge, and... We do various things with that. We can put the cube on the button for starters, that seems like a good idea, right? Oh, that's only one of two requirements for that. Okay. What do we have up here, though? Flip panels. And a fizzler engrating. Interesting. Well, I must say the aesthetics here look nice. So nice work on that. Interesting. Dot. What does that go to, though? Just a random dot signage there. I can't tell what that's connected to. Huh. This is a little spot there. Let's investigate in this direction, shall we? Ah, that seems like a place where we want a cube, right? Let's go get the cube real quick. Also, this music that's playing is from Rexora. I forgot to mention it, who was in the description, but yeah, good old Rexora music. I think it's Rexora, right? Yeah. Alright. And carefully. There we go. So there's that. What exactly does that do for us? Wait, what? Oh, okay. Interesting. Do we only need that temporarily, or... Huh. I'm gonna say we need it for now. Cause it isn't- it is a second requirement for that. But whenever we put a cube on there... It respawns this. We can't put this cube... We can't swap out the cubes at all because of the way that button is a cube button. So this cube has to go onto this button over here. So far not much of a puzzle yet, but we shall see. We shall see. What is going on here? Interesting. So we can get across here easily enough. This is our exit requirement, we just need two cubes and a laser, right? Yes, two cubes and a laser. Understood. What do we have up here, a laser cube? Yes, laser cube. Oh, it's my- uh... It's very close to my favorite shade of green. Not exactly my favorite shade, you can see... Ah, well, it's, it's not a good comparison to the light bridges, but whatever. We could- we had a hard time getting the light bridges to be the shade of green that I like. Because, when you try to color a light bridge, you have to remember it's also transparent, and so it'll look weird on a white surface behind it versus a black surface behind it, and then also whatever effects the game applies to it. It was a pain to color, but I really appreciate Aaron taking the time to do it with me. Right. Oh, this is open now. What- did I do that, or...? Oh, it's because of that! Right, okay. So, just getting here activated that, which opened this now. Wait a second. Oh, okay. What is the dot signage connected to, though? I thought the dot signage might have been connected to this. Apparently this just does not have signage at all. Interesting. Hmm. What raises and lowers the platform? There's also that laser, which doesn't appear to have any signage. What's with that, though? That's just... two? I mean, steps two, right? The signage is confusing, because that has no signage, 
So, I don't actually even know what to do, should I want to activate that. Huh. Oh, there's a portal surface up there. Didn't even see that. Let's investigate this. Save, and continue. What does this do for us? Uh... Quite frankly, nothing that I can discern. What did that do for us? Is it something out here? No. What did that do for us? Wait, when did this laser turn on? I thought I I thought I looked at it and it was definitely not turned on. Am I going crazy here? I looked at it and it wasn't turned on. Is it on a delay? Now it's- now it's just permanently on? Huh? Is it like a delay on it? Or... What is happening? I don't understand what's happening in this- in this map. Well, that's the thing I can do. Um... The heck, man? I don't understand. That's interesting. Well, at this point, I think it's pretty trivial to get out of here, so... Let's just, uh... Let's just get out of here, then. So here's one cube. And we can go to the other cube. This one, if we pick it up, it might respawn the cube that we already placed. Okay, thankfully didn't. Am I missing something? Like... Where was the puzzle? I didn't even have to use that... portal surface at all. Yeah, what was... what was this about? I didn't even use this. I didn't even use this at all, um... Well, I guess I'm gonna have to replay this map. <laughs> right, well... As always, thank Impressive. you so much for watching, I really appreciate it, and I'll see you all in another video. Goodbye!